Hey guys, Ultimate Recon Gaming updates number 49, week of July 31st. Um, yeah, so let's go ahead and get started. I'm kind of half asleep, to be honest with you. Been like that for the past couple days. Uh, what the crap is wrong with this thing now? We got issues all crazy. Okay, anyways, the, the what year game? Um, what year did Con uh, blah, 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 blah. Rainbow Six? What year did Rainbow Six Siege Vegas Two come out? Well, I'll give you a moment to guess. If you guess March 18, two thousand eight, you are correct. Actually, if you're correct, if you just guessed two thousand eight, because it says what year? Anyways, nice dignity. Yeah. And uh, be kind of cool, and then if you get interactive and be like, yeah, I got it. And down in the comments, you know. Anyway, schedules. Uh, channel news schedules. So, we'll go with the schedule first. We got three videos this week. On Tuesday, we got NBA 2K17, 2K17 episode 17. Better say that four times fast. Stoneheart episode 2 on Wednesday, and then Thursday, we have episode 18 of NBA. Um, we have actually finally finished the season um which you guys know the playoffs is coming pretty soon but i mean the actual full like season one of what we're going to call season one so episode 21 was the last one um which is the probably shouldn't even said that to be honest um but let's just put it this way the very last episode um the very last episode um, mentioned that stay tuned for season two. Season two may or may not happen. We really want to do season two, but season two may or may not happen only because we're we're trying to start filming season two already, and we've kind of ran into some issues with the game itself. Um, we may have to try to figure something else out if there is going to be a season two. Um, the game itself is running th uh, some errors, let's put it that way, um, when we're trying to fix stuff. So, we, yeah. Anyways, other than that, I think that's all I have for news on this channel so far. Um, betas. I just recently, just literally just recently played a beta called Dead Alliance. It ends July 31st by the time this comes out. I think that's the last day for it. I don't don't quote me on that. It's here today's the last day or already ended today. Anyways, um so I always record this the day before. Um basically this game it was a great idea. Um I love the concept to it. It's basically Call of Duty with zombies in the middle of it. And these zombies are let's just say stupid <laughs> um the, the, the it wasn't a bad idea to put the zombies in they're just not that smart um and there's not really many of them to be honest um i would actually suggest um there's still obviously i think and from what i think is that there still needs to, there's some still uh, work to be done like rendering wise um a couple issues i ran into is that i was getting hit and I was, I shouldn't have been getting hit because I was behind cover. So like I was getting shot, like, like, um, for example, like here's the building, here's the corner like this concrete building, by the way, bullets are not going to fly through that. Plus on top of that, I was getting hit by like zombies and I wasn't even near them. I had to happen a couple times, but I think I died like a total, like two, maybe three times tops in that entire game. Um, one thing that was absolutely annoying is that I had to reload the game every time I played a match. That was ridiculous. Um, yeah, just absolutely ridiculous. Um, it had preset loadouts. I really liked the crossbow. The crossbow was kind of cool, but I, you know, it was, it's kind of annoying to have to reload after every shot, but it's silent. It is absolutely silent, but it doesn't really do too much damage to your opponents. On the one hand, on the other hand, though, if you use a regular gun, it does more damage to your opponents, but it makes you more alert to the zombies. 
So uh, that one, I was just kind of running through zombies and wasn't getting hit. I was just able to swerve through them. And, you know, I had this one guy, he was, the zombie was following him. He didn't realize it. And I just kind of, like, I saw him. But I popped around the corner head. And I was like, okay. And for some reason, he was on my radar, and I don't know why. But I pulled up and went knife the zombie behind him so I would not have to worry about him. And then I was like, duh, 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 duh. and I turned and I saw his teammate deal with another zombie. I was like, okay. And I turned and went, duh, duh, duh. <laughs> got them both. It was kind of nice. Then I got snuck up on um, by a zombie that wasn't even hitting me that apparently was. Um, anyways, other than that, um, I also think they could put more potential into it. It's not... There was, I think I had like a, I think there needs to put more fear into it. Um, make it more fearful, I guess you could say, because I kind of went in there thinking, I saw the trailer, the trailer was, it's really awesome. The trailer is really awesome, really great, really well thought out. But you get to the game and it's like, the trailer makes you think like there's thousands of zombies everywhere. You get to the game, the map is super small. And you're kind of like, I get in the game first time and I'm kind of actually like, actually looking you know, and then I'm thinking they're like a real threat, but honestly, there's not really a threat. You just kind of, it's, it's literally just more like Call of Duty, they're just an obstacle, just go around them. Now, okay, now until you run into the, jun the jungle zombie, then it's a little bit difficult because the jungle zombies can run. So, those I would advise taking out ASAP. Um, Anyways, yeah, there's a couple things they could fix. Um, by the way, this is not sponsored by them. I just brought it up because it's beta. But um, I, there's obviously a couple things they could fix. And if they're watching this, cool. Um, they get feedback this way. Anyways, that's the Xbox controller. <laughs> a few games this week. July 31st to August 6th is Avon Colony. That's the only one that's like came to big name wise don't know exactly what it is i'm guessing probably some kind of silly build kind of game so no top five countdown gamer score leaderboard said in seventh place sub dog 44 with a gamer score of 5465 surviving one of 50 i could at uh, sixth place i could do fit uh, with 5870 didn't go up at all fifth place blood saving with a gamer score 20,405 hasn't went up at all either either Fourth place, Atomic Way 21 with a gamer score 20,815. He's went up 15. And third place, Lodge 45 Viewers to see with, 20, uh, with a gamer score 26,170. He's got 20. And second place, Sergeant Curly 25 with a gamer score 35,829. He hasn't gone up at all. And in uh, first place, the gamer score 53,092. Uh, going up 295 gamer scores. Dragon 888. I think I said enough hates. So that's me, by the way. Anyways. Usually this last hat, uh, this last like three minutes of this show just go by quickly, if it's even three minutes at all. Anyways, guys, thanks for watching. Make sure to con leave comments down below or what we call comments. If it's basically anything you have questions about us or uh, whatever else. Also, there's always a form, a uh, questionnaire down below. I say form, but it's a questionnaire down below. If you just want to go down to there, it's like f five to ten questions. I don't think it's really ten questions. It takes you less than five minutes just to do it just kind of basically gives us feedback so we know what you guys like what you guys want to continue seeing and it also lets us know what you guys want to see as well also on top of that um i did want to mention this um series is coming back but back differently and so is trial um trials is coming back just not soon it's coming back just later on in the year and um it actually i think it starts coming back soon as stone Heart is done which is six episodes um so that's that should be like right there i'm pretty sure it is or at least a month after that anyways um and everything's obviously pre-recorded um the series is coming back but not exactly the same so obviously series um there are several ways we've done it already we've done it like we do four game. It was originally you did. We did four games, and it was like rotated between uh, each day of the week. So uh, only one game would only come out once that week, but it was promised twice that next week. Um, so it'd be like 
a game one, game two, game three, game four, game one, game two, game three, and then down here be four, one, two, three, four, one, two, and then so on and so forth. Um, and it just keeps rolling like that for the week. And then we went, okay, this is too hectic. Let's do, we get four games, and then we'll go, well, each one gets a day of the week. So Monday, Wednesday, uh, Monday, Friday, Sunday, Saturday, that was the days of the week. And it was like, okay, and then once a week for each game. So then each one got an episode a week. Then that was getting too hectic. So we dropped it down. We said, okay, uh, once the thing ends, it ends. And it was like either if it reached 30 episodes first or if it we decided we were just done. Um, and then series was canceled for the second time <laughs> or third time. Anyways, I don't know if it's second or third, but it's coming back again, but different. This time it's actually going to be called solo plays. Now, when you read the description, it's not going to say solo plays. It's going to, a solo is going to be replaced by a name. Um, so it could be like Johnny plays or Preston plays or whatever, or whoever is what I should say. And it will say plays, and then it'll say the name of the game, and then the episode number. Um, so that way, it's it's kind of revamping it, but it's still series, and it's not. It's also um, we kind of I kind of want to put this out that solo plays is not going to be like series where you're promised a whole bunch of episodes or at least a good amount. Um, I can tell you that soul plays because tryout. Here's the difference between tryouts and soul plays. Tryouts is usually your promise no more than two episodes, and typically it's a game that can only make in one episode anyways, and it's typically just to try it out, you know. And it's usually typically a demo. Sometimes it's not. We actually have two that's not demos are actually free to play games, um, that's already pre-recorded, but um, they just kind of been thrown in there. It's because they're going to make one con a, one, a one video content. And we just kind of want to throw it out there. But, uh, on the other hand, um, Solo Plays, you promised at least three episodes. So, three episodes. So, if we could figure, if we could make three episodes at least, it will just kind of give you a basic start of that game. And then, for the most part, I'm going to try to stick to six. Doesn't mean I will, but I will, for the most part, when I do Solo Plays, I'll try to stick to six, five or six, typically. Um, just so you guys can get a, you know, basically the tutorial and then the startup and then a little bit past the startup. And then if I decide to continue from there and, or if you guys convince me that you really want that much more, then I'll see if I can put more into it. Um, and then we'll go from there. Um, but just remember that soul players are not promised like 30, 40, 50 episodes doesn't mean that you're going you're not going to get 30 40 50 episodes it's just remember that you're not promised to get that much um obviously collabs still exist it's just been a while we're we're still working on getting the collabs together and as well i guess there is more channel news i guess than i thought um goofing around videos there's a couple more coming in um it's been a while since we actually done some um i think sports crazy after NBA ends, I think there's a small break before Madden comes in, and then of course we're gonna we're gonna do a NASCAR thing, which is actually I think in the draft we said we're gonna do every single track. That's not true because that's just gonna take way too long. I think we're gonna do ten races max. So that's ten episodes, um, and then we're gonna have a winner at the end of the tenth episode because we're gonna do like the um, the series that they do like the we're gonna keep our own little score and then like. The top 16 will make it, and then um, the last four races will determine. So, like the seventh race, seven, eight, nine, ten, yes, seventh race, the sixth race will determine the top 16, and then the seventh race, four will be eliminated, and then the next four on the eighth, and the next four for that, and the ninth, eighth, and then the tenth race, the final four will compete for getting the win overall. And obviously, the way you do that is you just say, okay, here's the points you get. And then, basically, if they make it on the next round, you just give them a thousand points. So that way, they get they not only get the points that they got for racing, but then they get a thousand points saying that they're moving on. So that way, you can keep them distance from the people that are out. Um, other than that, that's pretty much the entire plan. Um, with that being said, I think we're done. Anyways, remember. 
I want to say this again. If you've got any comments, questions, or comments, put them down below. In the comment section, make sure to fill out the questionnaire. I mean, it really helps. It really does. Um, also, um, make sure you, you know, like and subscribe. Be really great. Anyways, guys, thanks for watching. Ultimate Recon Gaming, and you have been updated.